Hi everybody, we're going to talk about what you can do at home if you don't have any paint. Um, I am creating this painting with a cup of coffee. So you can see that I tried to um, create a value scale uh, with seven boxes. And what I did was I put kind of a drop on each square and I let it dry. Really try to use your patience and just do that. I started a little bit and you can see once you start layering um, the shadows kind of pop out. I know it's kind of hard to see um, on camera but um, as you put the coffee down really use your patience and let it dry. Um, the darker areas I started with first creating a light value and you want to leave those light areas just the white of the paper. Treat it sort of like watercolor paint. And then you want to build up that surface. Um, if I just do the regular coffee, um, it creates a nice really light tone right here. And as you can see, I'm starting to build up you know, all of these different ones. Um, so I want to look carefully at what just at what I'm doing um, and look at your reference I have a coffee pot that I drew out just in pencil I am using watercolor paper um, I've got just a paintbrush and uh, you know my little ruler here you can measure it out and a paper towel to kind of dab off anything now if I wanted to create a little more of a transition you know I have to wait you can see the layers um, of the value scale that I did so be patient with this but you know it's kind of fun to try to paint and use other uh, materials that you have at home hi Sally um, to try to you know kind of fight the boredom so if you are bored and you want to do something kind of fun try to use other things that um, you necessarily wouldn't use before. You can see this value is starting to build up. And I do want to use my patience. Um, I'm probably going to let this dry just like this and then once it's completely dry I'll go back and add some more of those darker values. But remember it's really important to um, only paint what you see. Paint what you see not what you know. Um, look at the highlights, look at the values really pay attention to that and things will start to take shape.